AOC on Twitch last night as well. How about fighting the coronavirus in your own home? Stanford is teaming up with some powerful names like Microsoft. They've developed a way for you to test yourself along with new software so they can track cases. Here's NBC Bay Area's Anusha Rasta with the details. Stanford wants to make testing for COVID-19 as simple as possible by sending you a kit like this in the mail so you can do the test yourself at home. Just fill out an online form and the university will send you a test kit within 24 hours. Swab the inside of your nose and mail the sample back. What we're doing is connecting testing capacity to people who need the tests. Stanford School of Medicine launched the research study this week called CATCH, the Community Alliance to Test Coronavirus at Home. Researchers say the study will help them figure out a more accurate number of COVID cases in the Bay Area and help them identify hotspots, too. What we want to do is track people who might be infected and people who aren't infected. The university developed an online program called Vera where people can log on, register and track their symptoms. Researchers need more people to register to participate in the study so they can see whether the at-home testing plan works for everyone. Angie Maurer from Danville already did. By the next day, um, almost 24 hours actually, um, I received my result, which was amazing. The steps and the equipment, the materials provided are very secure, very uh, well done. Instructions are super simple. Arthur Liberman is 80 years old and a retired scientist. He believes Stanford's test is the safest way for vulnerable groups like himself to check for coronavirus. This way, I was at home. I had really absolutely zero possibility of contracting anything, so I, I was very comfortable about doing it. Researchers say they've tested about 2,000 people so far, but they're hoping for 100,000. The test is free, and the university expects to know in a couple months whether the plan will work for the public. Anusha Rasta, NBC Bay Area News.